another day, another appointment. Not for me, for him. And today I need to fix this. <laughs> My hair grows stupid fast. <sighs> okay. No clue where I'm going to figure it out. It ain't that hard. And that's a road where the wind is blowing. The whole damn world is my backyard. Last night I slept on the edge of a mountain. Tonight I'll sleep on Sunset Strip. Next week it's down on Cocoa Beach. And then back on the road to the roof. 666. Goodness, welcome to February 2024 in Michigan. It is stunningly beautiful outside. It's like 52 degrees. I got a hoodie on. I don't even feel like wearing this hoodie. I was hoping I'd have time to lose a little weight before I got off the hoodies, but okay, we got appointments first though. I want to go magnet fishing with my magnetar stuff, which has been sitting here since it got cold. I'm bummed about that. Not bummed about it, but I just want to uh, take it for a spin, man. We'll find some underwater treasures. I've been wanting to do that for months. But no, it's got to get cold. Yeah. I mean, that's because what the, uh, yeah. So he's in there getting a brain scan. So they have to, uh, where the hell am I going? inject a bunch of dye and take pictures of his brain to see if there's anything out there just trying to figure out what's going on with him <sighs> cancer's a bitch people so i'm gonna go to the cafeteria why i don't know i've been there before it was not great it smells good but i just like cafeterias simple as that i think they're funny get a philly cheese thing what is what is this i don't know what this is I mean, chicken sandwich. Remember the fries were good. Ooh, burrito station, hmm. So yeah, I will not be eating at this cafeteria ever again. Ah, oh, I should have got a burrito. I tried a little bit, of, just a taster of the uh, chicken and dumplings, which I love chicken and dumplings. They had no flavor, they were terrible. Terrible texture. Fries were cold and old. Okay, UPS, done. I uh, sent a bunch of those postcards I got from around the country to, I guess it's a special needs class of kids in uh, Kentucky. My awesome friend, Courtney, uh, who I often call the mashed potatoes. We call each other that. Um, there's a long story behind that. Anyway, so I'm gonna send them that, those for Valentine. They should get there just in time. I'm gonna order them some donuts too. My radio playing is... You don't normally hear people thumping their garbage music uh, in this town, believe it or not. You don't normally don't hear it. Like, I never hear it. It's, it's kind of wonderful. Uh, like, in Colorado Springs, it's every 15 minutes because our place is a shithole. But it's... Uh, I'm not listening to Pearl Jam Radio. Okay. Oh, nations. Left their Coke can in there, real nice. Morning. Days are just blurring into one another. Another morning, another meeting, another appointment. Oh, another physical therapy drop. Not feeling so good today. Right it's kind of funny because you know you it, it's this, you know what I mean? It's it's actually like this. It's like you got days where he's just good, and then you got days like today where it's it is what it is. They were playing some kind of like pop hip hop bullshit in there. Like I'm like looking around, there's like four people in the place and they all got gray hair. And they're all his age and older than me. And so I'm like, I don't 
can you change this? <laughs> like, put some 70s classic rock on or something, man, because uh, nobody wants to hear this shit unless you're under 30, which you're a child if you're under 30 and you don't know what good music is. She works here. She's out here smoking every single day right in front of the door. That is the entrance right there. So, of course, I've got more shopping to do. <laughs> it's never ending, man. Never freaking ending. I go buy a little cat box. Because one of their cats has kind of uh, decided to make the rest of the house a uh, cat box. So we're going to put a cat box upstairs. Anyways, why am I telling you this? I just have a lot of running around to do. I won't bore you with that. Okay, I am not in a handicap. Cool. But you can't even tell where the handicap is. But this sign right here makes it seem like it's everything. Okay. I'm going to shut up now. By a cat box. Mmm, ferrets. Hey, buddy. What you doing in there? I've never been in a pet supplies plus before. I look tired, don't I? I feel tired. What? Hey, dude. Uh, clown. Or yeah, I don't blame I've never him. Seen him like that. <laughs> hey, buddy. Do they sell scorpions here, really? Scorpions. Is there one in there? There is one in there. Something in there. Framed cat pan sifting. Oh, so you just pick up the thing and shake it out. Cool. I'm in on that. Oh, there's a Mauser. Hey, sweetie. Hi, handsome. You hate being in here, don't you? Oh, I wish I could take you. Oh, dude, you're so pretty. You're so pretty. Oh. I gotta run away from you, though, because I'm tempted to buy you. I know. Don't be mad. Successful trip to the pet store. We've done it. It is 55 degrees in Michigan, early February. Pretty outstanding, man. I'm pretty uh, pretty grateful some, for some great, uh, global warming at the moment. I don't know if that's it for winter. I, I highly doubt it, but it's, uh, it's very nice out. Again, I'm a little, a little bummed that uh, hoodie weather is like kind of heading out, you know? I love hoodie weather. It's my favorite weather. I can hide my terrible body at the moment behind this hoodie. <laughs> so I'm heading to Wyandotte. There's a health store there, food store, vitamin store. I want to grab some stuff from. Sorry, Freddie Scott. And uh, it's really the only one in this whole area. It's kind of crazy. There's no Whole Foods, no, uh, what do they call it? Uh, Trader's, not even a Trader Joe's. Um, you got to go a long way to get to those places, like in a half an hour, hour drive. And there's this huge, like this whole uh, area right here in southeastern Michigan that's just, it's, it's, it's populated, man. It's like, and, and the people here are, are, they need, you know, health foods and things like that. And I don't understand why there's nothing here. I like this little wine dot place, this little city of wine dot. A little shopping district here. There's a little something for everybody. Some cool shops. And we got time, so. Cool. We have made it. There we go. A little mom and pop looking Whole Foods type of looking sprouty looking health food looking place. Okay. What is this? Catnip tea, really? Is that for people? Cat's claw? Inner bark. That doesn't make sense. Cats don't bark. Stuff. Hey, look at this. Watch a little carpet bagger over there and we got new coloring books. Made by me. Yay. Cows and goats, how freaking cute. I have two more, 
already submitted. Then I have two more to make. So that'll be a total of 23. Yeah, I've made 21 coloring books in two months. Thank you again to Gary. Damn, I wanna be doing what he's doing right now. It's driving me crazy. He's just going around having all this good fun, seeing all this cool stuff, filming it, and I wanna, oh, I gotta get out. Just in case you didn't know, I make the best um, chicken and noodle soup in the world. Just in case you didn't know, I, I maybe you did know. But that right there is the best. Look at this, big chunky meats, juicy meat, homemade Amish noodles. Are you kidding me? Terminix is at the house. Not because there's a bug problem, but because we want, don't want there to be a bug problem. And me, I am in 100% cut the shit mode. I have weighed in at 265 pounds last night. And I'm ashamed of how I look. I'm embarrassed. My confidence is crap. And I'm done. I'm just done. Not with life. <laughs> I'm just saying I'm done doing the things I've been doing. Eating like crap and not going for my 10,000 steps a day and, you know, going to the gym. That's going to happen today and all kinds of crap. So <clears throat> I'm not going to go crazy into it because that's how people fail, but I'm going to ease into a new lifestyle and <sighs> I've got to lose 35 pounds. Have to. One of the best things about living in a van is I don't have a giant fridge or means to cook things 24 seven around me. Yes, I can still intermittent fast. I've been doing that for the most part since I've been here. But man, I've just been cooking so much and eating so much. I love walking, man, but it just gets so boring walking the same places every day. So I'm going to have to figure something out. Historically speaking, I lose weight rather quickly um, when I get started and I'm in the zone. As I say, I usually can drop 20 pounds in probably a month or two. Yeah, I'm not making that up. It just flies off me. So either I'm just full of shit, which I truly believe I am. And it just, uh, you know, melts away or, uh, you know, I just have a really high metabolism for losing weight like that. Um, so then I hit a wall <laughs> where I'll lose that 20 pounds, but then I hit, I can't lose anything else. I just can't. And I'm always afraid of that, but I'd be happy as hell to lose that 20 pounds. Hey, look, a bridge. And a bunch of squirrels. Holy God, a bunch of squirrels. So many squirrels here. I might, and I'm saying the word might here. Big capital letters, might. Put on my uh, Bass Dash. God, there's so many squirrels here. It's crazy. My Bass Dash uh, waders. You know, my big rubber pants that go up to about right here. I might, since I hate littering so much, and I hate litterers so much, put on my Bass Dash uh, waders and go through this swamp. There's no alligators in Michigan. Uh, and start cleaning up all this trash. Maybe take a different, that'd be a great way to get some exercise. Try out the Bass Dash waders. Um, I have not been able to. I got them like right when winter hit. You know what I mean? So, look at this squirrel. The squirrel doesn't give a damn. It's like, none shall pass. What are you doing, buddy? You just don't care, do you? Just wait until I turn my back. I don't know what you're up to. You stay back there. I don't want no problem with no squirrels. I watch Rick and Morty. I know what happens. I think that would be cool to, uh, A, clean this place up, especially on that side of it. Over here seems pretty nice. But uh, B, good exercise, 
see, check out the waders, make sure they're good. I mean, you got bottles over here amongst the squirrels. Just people just, eh, hey, fuck, I don't care. Yeah, I'm stupid. Bad. That's what you are if you litter. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. I, I hate you. Look at this. Look at all that trash right there. Look at that. This is not a ghetto area. You know what I mean? This is a decent little nice area. Look at that. That is a bag's worth of trash right there. Plus, there's a couple softballs. There's a football. There's, there's like four softballs and a football right there. And a tire. And a bunch of cups and bottles. I think I'm going to do that. Got a couple of duckos up here blocking the path now. What's up, ducko? You guys having a nice out? The whole family of duckos over here. Hey, guys. I'm going to clean up your pond here pretty soon, I promise, okay? So don't get mad at me when I'm doing it. Seriously. Even at town hall. People suck. With the stretch. <laughs> I always forget the stretch and then I feel like shit. Still pretty flexible for 50, right? Okay, I am finally getting to eat. It's almost two o'clock, exactly 1.55. But we got mail first. You know, me and my mail. That usually means more shirts. Mm-hmm. Look at even. Happy Easter! <laughs> I ordered another blanket. And here we go. You're going to love this one. If you're a fan of the movie that I made with Vinny Vineyard, uh, my movie writing and directorial debut in a movie called Vinny's Fantastic Rock and Roll Adventure, well, it's merchandise time. Oh, yes. Try not to hit the fan again. Look at this. Awesome. And it's, I, I don't know what they make these out of. It's like a fleece, an Arctic fleece, I think they call it. This happens to be the most comfortable blanket. That's why I ordered it for myself, because I really wanted it. This is a very, 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 very beautiful, huge, and comfortable blanket. I think it costs like 35 bucks on my Etsy shop. If you go to Etsy, look up the Human Shirt Company. You'll see all my designs. It'll be in the description as well. And you can buy this as well. This is the most, they got three sizes. They're both smaller than this, but huge, comfy, and kick-ass. And it represents my movie. Yay. I'm eating chicken thighs cooked in olive oil, baked, and some broccoli with very little seasoning on it. And it's very good, by the way. I'm not complaining. In the mug, I made tea, my Rubio's tea, with uh, cardamom seeds, milk thistle, thistle turmeric, cinnamon stick, a little bit of creamer, no sugar creamer. Um, there's something else. <clears throat> there's something else, but it's supposed to be really, really, really healthy. <sighs> so, here we go, right? Oh, ginger. Sliced raw ginger. Yeah, and there's a lot of that in there. I did not work out at all today because my back, for some reason, I don't know if I slept wrong. I don't know if it was for the five-mile walk. My back sucks. other nuts. It's a 
dirty looking table. Mm -hmm. Little plug on the back. I have to remember where she got this. All right, I got packages. I got packages. I've got a nice package. Big and black. The way you like it. I don't know what's in here. Oh, look, more shirts. <laughs> Stop back soon. New designs weekly. Thanks. You're the coolest. There's the uh, QR code to my shirt shop, so. Cool logo. That's a great logo. I don't remember what shirt this is. Cool. <laughs> I don't know why I made this shirt. I just think it's cool. Now this package is nice and big. I think it's three shirts. Pretty sure. Ooh, I know what these are. Cool. Yeah, that's the record shirt, record store we used to go to when I was just a baby. I guess she was kind of just a baby too. That looks awesome. Cool. Haha, <laughs> it's awesome. I shouldn't be sharing any of this with you, but um, this is kind of who I get to talk to anyway. Um, so I guess the uh, cancer spread got upstairs. They're gonna treat it, fight it, you know, of course. So it's not a it's not a death sentence, but it's, you know, just a few days ago he did a whole scope and they said all the you know, the cancer stuff was gone and uh, there's nothing to be seen, but now we're getting, you know, lesions on the brain and Okay, I'm leaving the house for the first time in a couple days now. And I'm driving the van for the first time in a lot of days. I'm glad it's still started and it's running good, right? I gotta get this shopping done. Gotta, 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 gotta get it done. I almost forgot how to drive this van though. Goodness, people. That is so much salt right there. Thank God. Oh yeah. You guys don't get to see the van very much anymore, do you? Here she is, looking all beautiful. He is, it's a he. say about going too black you wait a little while and it'll be gray again another day at PT oh man I'm gonna go get more chicken since we smoked the salmon and we smoked the brisket, this guy wants to smoke everything now, except for not smoking, you know, smoke food. Um, yeah, you'll never catch me smoking. That's the dumbest thing you could possibly do. This would make an amazing pea bottle. Wait, no, it's got the straw on it. Ugh. It's the problem with my pee bottle is I fill that damn thing up all the time. I pee a lot. It's true. There's not that many in here. Have this stuff. 
don't get it. I don't know why it's so good, but it is. I'm gonna look just like her. No, this is not for me. <laughs> it's Valentine's for my mom, okay? I'm not eating a damn cookie, I promise you. She really likes these a lot, so they will be from Ron to my mom. I'm gonna give him a nice Valentine's. We got new stuff, Valentine's M&M's. That's dangerous. Looks like somebody tried to eat that one. Ooh. I got a text at the same time saying so thank you for tasting crumb. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, have a great day. I'm gonna smoke some chicken titties tonight. But I gotta clean up the mess I made with the brisket. I might just keep that on there for flavor. God, this whole thing smells so good. <laughs> I decided to start snowing out. That's weird. It came out of nowhere. I had to go down there and put a towel on the smoker. Still got about an hour left. My smoked chicken tastes fantastic a little dry but it tastes as good as any chicken i've had in any barbecue smoked chicken places so good deal a little dry i don't know how to combat that um i may have cooked it a little too long but last time i checked it like an hour ago it wasn't even done yet so it's good though Good morning. Another appointment, another day. Mm, early one this time, though. Back of the house. Dropped off the man. Gotta run and go to the store again. <laughs> oh, shut up. No, my van stuff just sitting on the shelves. Like all of this is just all of that, all of this. There's so much stuff. Like everything you need for van life is right there. You got all your Road Pro stuff. All my God, Road Pro sent me a lot of stuff, man. I love Road Pro. Um, all my power units and everything. I'm not going to say Jackery because uh, we may be getting a new power supplier here pretty soon. What the hell? Yeah, all my camera stuff, all my lighting. Magnet fishing stuff is all down there. Oh my Metal detectors. Lunacy, man. Lunacy. So much lunacy. They really, really need to rename these. It's very unfortunate. coming but not till March 24th. <laughs> I know. Is that cool? That's perfect. Can I hit you with this? Please do. Okay. That's beautiful. Honey. Hope it fits. Oh, it's just one of those fits everybody. Honey. Oh, is it? Yeah, honey. Perfect. You gotta adjust it, I hope. No. <laughs> this is the way I want to look for you. <laughs> it's an eyeball. Oh, cute! I love that. <laughs> this is so cool, dear. Oh, there you go. Yay. I'm going to try to watch A&W. <laughs> going to get me a chili dog and a root beer. No, I'm going to try to watch AEW. My mom got this for her... What? What was that for? Christmas, I think? <laughs> I don't know if I like this or not. It's not up to me, but it's uh, uh, that thing over there, which blinds you when you walk by it. But it's an interesting little ceiling thing. It's, I don't know if that's neat or nauseating. What do you think? <laughs> 